Our brains are composed of billions of neurons in constant communication with each other. Their language? Electrical impulses. A disruption in this typically balanced signaling network, however, can result in abnormal discharge, an electrical storm of sorts, in the brain. This is what causes seizures. Epilepsy, a neurological disorder marked by recurrent, sudden seizures, affects millions of people worldwide. Unfortunately, for nearly one-third of these patients, medications don't work. Surgery to remove the affected area is a potential treatment option, but carries high risks when it involves critical parts of the brain that control memory, language, movement, or vision. Enter Brain Responsive Neurostimulation. Studies have found that delivering a brief electrical signal to targeted regions of the brain can be a safe and effective treatment for epilepsy patients. The RNS system's wires are placed directly into the affected brain regions without the need to remove any brain tissue. The neurostimulator, implanted in the skull, is then able to sense abnormal electrical activity and respond by sending pulses to counteract these events, without the patient feeling a thing. Following a total of 256 participants in an open-label study over an average of six years, a team of U.S. researchers closely monitored how well this recently developed neurostimulator controlled seizures. The study population included 111 participants with seizures originating from the mesial temporal lobe and 126 from the neocortex. The treatment resulted in substantial median seizure reductions in both groups, between 51 and 70 percent at last follow-up, depending on the location in the brain where the seizures originated. Before treatment, the average patient had more than 10 seizures a month. During the trial, 26 percent of neocortical and 29 percent of mesial temporal patients experienced at least one seizure-free period that lasted six months or more, and approximately 15 percent of patients in both groups went one year or longer without a seizure. The study found that the stimulation treatment was not felt by patients and did not cause acute or chronic neurological deficits, even in eloquent cortical areas. Surgical risks, such as infection and neurological complications, were low and comparable to other epilepsy procedures and other devices used to treat neurological conditions. And, thanks to its ability to record brain activity, both patients and physicians benefit from monitoring changes in electrical signals and personalizing treatment according to the individual's unique seizure fingerprint. The long-term study continues to suggest that the RNS system is a safe, reversible treatment option for adults with partial-onset seizures that can result in substantial seizure reduction.